So for this video, I wanted to test to see how practical sniping was. So what I've done is I've taken, I mean, this video is intended for the average player because I already have my opinion on it. But um, what I've done is I've gone and used an average player setup. So I've got optics, rammer, G and VSTAB, and I've got BIA and things like that. So I think effectively my accuracy is like 0.29 or 0.3. We'll see after this. But what we're going to do is we're going to shoot at this still IS-7. And uh, we're at 420 meters, and we'll just see how, how consistently I can actually hit this lower plate. So let's get started. But here's my setup for now. I guess I'll just explain it right here. Here's my setup. I've got optics, rammer, V-stab. This is very normal. Well, this is what most people will use on this vehicle. You can see that adds up to 0.28 accuracy. So it's about as good as you're going to get unless you decide to run foods and food and vents. But the reality is you shouldn't really be running vents if you're not carrying food. So this is normally what people would run. So we'll try the T95 next. All right, so at this range, I've tested, you can see there's a mark right here. I'm not gonna be able to consistently pen his lower plate. So we're gonna start at 35 shells, and then uh, we're just gonna go for his left commander's hatch and actually see how consistently 0.28 accuracy can hit this. Okay, uh, so we started at 35, we ended with 17 shells left, I think. I don't remember, you can see. I'll go back and count them or whatever, but this is just insane. Like, <laughs> there's, this, there's this whole misconception that you need to aim for weak spots and things like that. And I was shooting at 330 meters. It's a, that's a realistic range for this, for this vehicle. And I still can't consistently hit a thing's commander's hatch. It's not, I, mean, I get that I'm shooting at a T95, but could you imagine if he was moving or, um, I don't know, wiggling his, his commander's hatch? Like, the reality is you're not going to consistently hit weak spots ever. But, um, yeah, I mean, I, I, <laughs> I'm not going to test. I've wasted enough credits on this video, but go. you're welcome to test this in a training room for yourself. But in my experience, it's a waste of time to focus on aiming. You have to focus on positioning because the only way you're going to pen heavies from the front reliably is to not shoot at their front. Unless you're shooting gold and you're at so close where you can actually consistently aim for something's weak spots. But at any sort of, in quotation, sniping range, you're not going to be able to pen even the lower plate of a mouse. You're not going to pen that reliably or its turret cheeks at 300 meters. So as, as demonstrated with the IS-7, it took me forever to, to even hope of hitting him at 400 meters. And, and that's the only like area where he won't spot me at that sort of range so um yeah that's pretty much it thanks for watching guys we'll just call it here thank you to pilgrim prismic and ruben for helping me out with this video because uh obviously i couldn't have done it without them so yeah thanks for watching i you know you can make your own conclusions for yourself but there you go bye